Virgos, hey lovies, what is going on with my love, love, lovies? I hope you guys are feeling well. Come on in, come on in, tell a friend, tell a friend, like, share, subscribe, do all those good things. I love you guys and I appreciate everything you do for me and my channel. This is our soul tribe, our family, and we love to see it grow. Welcome to all our new family members, sending you a multitude of love, light, and positive energy as always. Virgo, I need y'all to help me sing our song this morning because I don't know. It's a little bit early, and I don't know if I'm going to be able to hit them notes. Let's hit it. Virgo, say my love. Hey, hey, my love. Hey, hey, my love. Sing it with me one time, sing. Hey, my loves. Hey, my loves. All right, all right, all right. I ain't do that bad this time. Let's get into the message. All of y'all who don't like me singing that song to you guys, don't click off. Just turn volume down real quick and then turn it back up because I got an amazing message each and every time. So let's see what Spirit wants to tell you on today. I feel like a lot of you guys are healing your heart, but forget all that. I got some amazing news for you, Virgo. You got some great energy surrounding you. This beautiful, blessed energy is bringing you in something wonderful, something that you have been wishing for, something that you have been praying for and asking for. And I had to come on here and do Virgo first. You know, I'm trying to work on our other channel, baby. But um, I had to come and give you this good news. So real, real quick, let's go ahead and dive in to the energy that is surrounding you on today. I really am excited about that. Let's see what the energy that surrounds you on today is. Real quick, we're gonna get our um, we're gonna get our angel messages and let the angels tell you some news about what may be coming towards you. Something is telling me to get these cards though, because I really feel like Spirit wanna do some talking. So let's just see what's happening. Let's see what this energy is that's coming towards you, Virgo. Real quick, let me cleanse our energy, even though it's already popping over here. Full of protection, love, and light. <laughs> you already know what you're going on to. So, Holy Spirit, Virgo, this is what I'm trying to tell you. This is what I'm trying to tell you, okay? This good, good energy that is surrounding you. You are full of hope and encouragement, and this is helping you win. Virgo, you got some good things coming in. Let me just go ahead and finish shuffling these cards. Somebody is definitely on a new beginning. I feel like you have a new job, um, a new home, a new opportunity, or this is just you renewing love for self. I feel like a lot of you overcame a lot of different obstacles, and this enabled you, empowered you to be able to forgive your past, and this unlocked so many doors and blessings. A lot of you decided that it's time. I'm healed. I can let this go. I'm not going to keep my emotions tied into this situation. Baby, when I tell you all oh, heaven broke loose, okay, the angels start rejoicing, spirits start working, the universe starts stirring that pot of goodness for Virgo. Baby, let's just go ahead and see what spirit wants to say because I'm overwhelmed with joy for you. I, I just am. So let's see what's happening. <laughs> ah, Holy Spirit, holy angels, thank you so much for blocking and binding every single negative energy, entity, witchcraft, wickedness, anything that's coming up against this channel or your divine will for me and my collective's lives, we thank you for banishing that energy. Thank you for giving us joy and abundance and overflow. Thank you for healing in our hearts, minds, bodies, souls, and spirits and victory in every situation we may face <laughs> right in the face of our enemies. Amen. Amen. And amen. Thank you for giving us a message of clarity, truth, love, and light. Okay, Virgo, let's see. Before I could even say anything, I just saw suffering in silence. So a lot of you are suffering in silence because you're using your resilience. You're using your faith. You're believing in the impossible because that's just how we move, okay? You walk by faith, not by sight because you know intuitively that good things are coming towards you. Some of you have been trapped in fear, not really sure how to move forward, not really knowing what the what this new beginning and this new chapter is going to bring you. But baby, this came out for a reason, okay? Trapped in fear. Show me what else for Virgo. But um, it's time for you to release that. For a lot of you, you're realizing that greater things are coming. You're coming up out of that energy. Let's see what may have had you trapped in fear real quick. I know I usually don't just stop like that, but I really want to know. And I want you to know. And I want you to see what may have you trapped in fear. Hold on. Let me get these blockage cards real quick, Virgo. Because we're about to um, get rid of this energy, honey. You already know I plant seeds of love, light, healing, encouragement, enlightenment. Okay? Let's see what's going on here. 
So what is keeping Virgo trapped in fear so they can rem be removed out of this energy? What is keeping Virgo trapped in fear so they can unblock this for their blessing? All right, because these blessings are big. All right, and you need to be unblocked for this. Oh, I hope I ain't showing too much, y'all. I'm trying to pull my little, my little top up. Guilt. All right, so you may be feeling guilty about some choices that you made. This says, I release any beliefs that no longer assist me in my soul's growth. So whatever is making you feel guilty, bringing you confusion, or making you feel stuck, like just going around the same cycle over and over, it's like it's putting you in a trance. Like you can't break free from this, but you can. That's just a feeling. All right, you have to release guilt, release, um, forgive yourself. Make sure you're forgiving the people that are around you or may have hurt you. People that you may have let in your life repeatedly and they didn't mean you any good. So this is what may be blocking you. This may be keeping you trapped in fear. Some type of feeling of guilt. Is there anything else? And then I saw friends. Let's see. What else is um, surrounding Virgo that may be keeping them trapped in fear? Doubt. Okay, so you have to release doubt. I release the need to know all the answers. So stop doubting yourself. Don't doubt your situation. Some of y'all are really um, manifesting in reverse because you might be telling yourself you don't deserve this amazing blessing that's coming in, but you do. There's no need for you to be fearful and don't doubt your intuition. I'm hearing trust your intuition and trust me. That's the message that I just heard. So I feel like spirit wants you to trust in divine timing and work in your life right now, okay? So let's see what else is here for Virgo. Tell Virgo about this energy that may be surrounding them. What else is going on with my Virgo spirit? What does Virgo need to know? Boom, what did I tell you, baby? Victory and success over your problems, over these strongholds, over the confusion, anything that is plaguing your mind or holding you back or making you stagnate, you are gonna be victorious over this. Okay, so let's see what else is here for Virgo. Show me clear messages. Something is moving really quickly. Something is about to happen fast. I'm telling you, Virgo, this wish is about to be granted for you. You're prepare yourself for this amazing blessing. It's happening fast. You, you're. It's like I don't think you believe that it's coming this quick. I don't know that you you trust. Like you, do you believe that this is coming? Because it's coming. I'm trying to tell you to make room for this blessing. You're going to be so happy. Wisdom. You could be getting words from the wise. I feel like this is you being wise. You're doing your studying. You're doing your research on whatever situation. Some of you guys know and you're learning more and more about how to be financially responsible. Some of you are preparing to buy a home. All right. I feel like this is having something to do with your stability, um, your finances, um, something good about it. Forming a solid foundation. You guys are building and growing. Yes. Um, and I feel like definitely passion ignited. Something really beautiful is about to happen for you. And I feel like whatever this thing is that you're going to be receiving is going to make you extremely fulfilled. You're going to feel so fulfilled and happy. But the overall energy is this has everything to do with you building your solid foundation. Okay. So spirit is trying to prepare you for what's to come. Let's see. Movement choices and decisions. So you're going to have a lot of deciding to do about this love that begins. And I feel like it can be just you falling in love with yourself, getting something new that you really, really wanted, this gift. Some of you, your wish being granted is a partner. All right. So this is coming in for you. Yes. After a time of feeling um, confused, memories of love is here. Obstacles and challenges, you're overcoming this, this new beginning. You're starting over. Some of you are, um, I feel like you are moving past the obstacles and challenges so let's really break this down let's see so victory and success is there anything black and virgo from their victory and success is there anything black and virgo from their victory and success what is this energy for virgo spirit show me clear messages please acceptance you have to accept, baby, that you are victorious. You are abundant. You are deserving of this positive energy that's coming to you. This is saying, I'm learning to accept the things that I cannot change. All right? You're walking away from those things that weigh you down or things that keep you in a state of confusion or stagnancy. Like, y'all tired of being stuck. So I feel you moving past this energy, moving on to this victorious situation. Sweetie, stop it. Get out of my video, girl. Sorry, y'all. She's so demanding. She just so jealous. But anyway, 
victory and success and the acceptance. I'm learning to accept the things I can't change. This is going to help you pivot forward. This is going to help you push past your enemies, push past the naysayers, and really walk in your power. Because that's what spirit wants you to do overall. God wants you walking in your power, feeling victorious, head held high. Because at the end of the day, you're a teacher, a guide for somebody else. Whether you feel like it or not, you definitely are an example. Okay, God is using you as an example, your very life, you know, your ups, downs, trials and tribulations and the way you're overcoming and being extreme, becoming extremely successful. You're winning every battle. Okay, that is somebody's um, example. All right. So let's see what else is here that may be blocking Virgo. What else may be blocking Virgo? And I feel like a lot of you need to you see how that is external noise. You need to block out the external noise. People trying to make you feel like you can't do something or you're not going to make it or like your voice doesn't matter. No, it does. And a lot of you are freeing yourself from doubt, freeing yourself from all these people that are pulling at your energy, making you feel um, less than or just tired and wore out. This says freedom. I possess the power and the free will to create my own happiness. So this is what a lot of you are doing. Yeah, so this is what a lot of you are doing. You're realizing that and it's making you victorious. Somebody here is changing their mind. It's like this is proof that you're winning the battle. All right, the battle of self, your inner demons, things that are trying to um, infiltrate in your positive thinking. You're winning the battle and this the something for good for you is coming in. And it's happening fast because you're winning the battle. It's an eight on the top of this card. So this is divinity. This is... Um, something that you've manifested. I feel like this is magical, a gift, something that you're going to be surprised at how fast it happens. Um, for some of you, you should, you're going to be feeling like I should have did this a long time ago. Hold on, Virgo. So Virgo, a lot of you are, um, choosing to be very lighthearted about the situation and the things that you're going through. A lot of you guys are funny. You're really good company. Your warm, um, energy and humorous energy actually helps people feel more comfortable so I feel like this is helping you. Yeah, this is helping you a lot. This is helping you a lot. I choose to focus on the lighter side of life. Glass half full. So you know that good things are coming. You know that you're going to be successful. So this is beautiful, beautiful energy for you to be in, Virgo. This is definitely helping you have a major victory in your life. And people see this. Show me accelerated motion. Whatever this is coming into Virgo fast, is there any blockages that they need to know about? So look on the brighter side of life, health. I will honor the physical vessel that enshrines my soul. So you want to make sure you keep yourself healthy, make healthier choices as far as your living habits and the things that you're doing to take care of yourself, eating habits and things like that, because something is happening fast. I feel like this is a blessing and Spirit is saying you need to be healthy to maintain this blessing. Anything else blocking Virgo? What is this? Uh, anything else for accelerated motion? Grief. All right. This is saying, I understand that losing something is an opportunity to appreciate this. So as fast as something happened or got taken away that didn't serve you, the faster something comes in to replace it. Because this is under accelerated motion. Anything blocking Virgo's wisdom, knowledge, whatever this is, five on top of this card. So there could be a bit of, they could have been a bit of mental conflict about something maybe you felt confused about how to move forward in this situation regarding home family a house learning could be school all right relationships underneath the bottom of the deck caught my attention so mind who you are spending your time with who are you investing your energy in the relationships that you have around you could be significant and play a very significant role and you being able to actually focus and learn the things you need to so you can elevate, all right? So be careful about the relationships and people that you surround yourself with, okay? Let's move forward. There is major growth in these areas for you, though, Virgo. Major, major growth. You should be proud of yourself. This energy is telling you to pat yourself on the back. I want to expand my consciousness and awareness. So you will and you are, a lot of you are becoming more emotionally mature and you're gaining a more of a regalness about you, meaning you're less likely to make careless mistakes or careless choices because you value your time, you value your energy and you understand you got a goal here more than just work, <laughs> okay? Your spiritual goal, that's what you're working on more and more these days. All right, so let's go ahead and clarify these cards with the tarot and see what this is coming out. Then we'll see what else Spirit wants to tell you and get you some advice for your day. 
or this energy that's coming towards you. All right. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, Ancestors, and Spirit Guides, show Virgo clear messages about what they need to know about this energy. We're going to use these to clarify, and then we're going to use this other tarot deck to tell you what's coming towards you. Let's see. Trapped in fear. What is this that Virgo may be trapped in fear about? Show Virgo clearly. What is this that Virgo may be trapped in fear about? Thank you guys for your love and your support. I appreciate you guys. Sending you so much love and light. As always, you already know the vibes. Let's see. Four of Swords. Rest, recovery, and meditation. So somebody could be trapped in fear as far as... I feel like while they're healing. Hmm. Trapped in fear. So let me see something here really quickly. Let's see. Let me get these cards to see a little bit more. Why is the Four of Swords here for Virgo? Why is somebody trapped in fear? Afraid. The Hierophant in reverse. So I feel like somebody could be healing from a relationship that's come to an end. Somebody could be trapped in fear and feeling spiritually depleted. Like maybe you need to re... re I feel like somebody needs to rededicate themselves maybe somebody needs to reconnect with spirit in the universe i feel like somebody definitely needs to recharge and rest with this hierophant energy in reverse okay um and the upright the hierophant is talking about spiritual beliefs the traditional teachings um maybe somebody is heartbroken and they feel like god let them down um but the truth is he didn't god never left your side spirit is definitely here and the way you're overcoming your obstacles and as much as you've grown in your life that is proof that god is definitely still here for you and with you helping you succeed okay for somebody needed to hear that yeah also somebody could be recovering from some type of um um manipulation because four is talking to us about recovery the four of swords um, healing from heartbreak because the three of swords is heartbreak. So this is the four of swords. So somebody is definitely recovering from, from some type of heartbreak. And with the Hierophant in reverse, it's talking about maybe somebody had a rigid attitude. Or this is somebody that may be trying to make you do something that you don't want to do. All right. Also, this could be talking about um, an end of a relationship or, at, or like I was saying, um, somebody is challenging your personal beliefs. Maybe somebody is trying to tell you that they don't believe in God. Somebody is trying to tell you that you shouldn't believe in God. Maybe somebody is trapped in fear because they don't believe. But whatever this is, I feel like your life is an example of why you should believe. And I feel like somebody is conflicted a little bit because they know God is real. And somebody else may be trying to make you feel like God is not real. You shouldn't believe in God. Or they're telling you that what you're doing is conflicting. Something like that. But there's victory and success here. Show me the energy that comes out of this Hierophant in reverse energy. What is going to happen in this situation for Virgo? And why is this here? Okay. So, okay. So, this is the end of a relationship. Somebody is trapped in fear. Not really knowing what to do. I feel like you're not really sure about where to go and what you're going to do now. Um, and I feel like you feel like a little bit, like somebody a little bit feels like God let them down. But it's not God letting you down. It's God actually helping you out of a situation so you can really fully be healed. See, you're asking for things and you have angels all around you and positive energy all around you that is sent to protect you, help you in a time of need and things like that. So this is necessary. This ending is necessary so you can fully heal. So Spirit wants you to come out of um, feeling like the cups are all spilled out, crying over spilled milk, because there are blessings coming in for you. There's abundance coming in for you, all right? There's some better energy coming in for you. Show me victory and success for my Virgo. So for any of you that are feeling like lackluster, tired, just feeling like nothing is happening for you, um, a lot of you are still healing from this relationship, but Spirit is saying, don't be fearful. You may feel like you understand that this can't be healed. Some of y'all are realizing that your marriage or your relationship can't be healed. Um, and, you're, and so it's a need for you to seek spiritual enlightenment, spiritual guidance. 
victory and success is here regarding some type of money situation so if you're waiting for money to come in you're about to get it this good news and this positive energy that i feel for you is definitely real like some of you are really going to get this blessing and you can prepare yourself for it. you're going to be extremely happy all right so this is good news money success or some type of here's here it is again so i feel like there's some type of offer some type of money i feel like this is you guys are going to be coming into some type of increase. Um, this is also an offer. So some type of job offer or somebody's offering you some assistance. I feel like there's more than one person here offering you some type of assistance to help you in your situation. Death, some type of transformation is happening. Or somebody is helping you through this time of an ending. Maybe something ended for you and now you're starting something new. Um, but I feel like that is here. Here it is. What I tell you, it's a beautiful opportunity, a blessing. And you guys are going to be victorious. You're going to feel so good. You're going to be excited, happy, ecstatic. Like it's a transformation. Somebody went from having something, feeling good. Then you could have had a little bit less. You've been offering, giving out too much or something like that. Because from the Knight of Pentacles to the Page of Pentacles. And then boom, you transform from the Page of Pentacles to the ace of pentacles somebody's getting us a huge blessing answer a big financial reward and this is going to be amazing like this is going to have you emotional queen of cups energy this guy this is going to have you a little bit emotional for my virgos like this is really good news and i feel like after a time of you feeling down sad feeling like your faith is being tested now boom god shows up like baby here i ain't going nowhere i ain't going nowhere you just had to make the moves i was waiting for you yeah, show me accelerated motion. Choose wisely. You're about to have all these options coming into you, and this is happening fast. You're gonna have to choose quick, but take your time. Like, don't like make sure you're examining all your options because somebody is about to have some options here. This is gonna be this is your wish. Whatever this is, this is your wish, and you gotta choose wisely. Choose wisely. Take your time and choose wisely. Whatever this is coming towards you. Wow. I love it. You are going to be so happy, Virgo. Look at this. Celebrating with your friends and family. You're going to be telling people the good news because something beautiful is happening. You're going to be so happy. Like, I feel, I almost feel emotional because in spirit is saying, don't, don't rush in. Take your time. With the Knight of Swords in reverse, don't rush in. Take your time. Be wise. Wisdom. So spirit wants you to use your wisdom when you're choosing this. Or when you're moving through with this blessing. It's like your wisdom. I feel like it's just like your wisdom. And, and the way you move. The way you are. The way you are concerned with family. And taking so much care of everybody. You earned this blessing. You deserve this. You earned this. For being so wise. So disciplined. I feel like you've been, been listening. And God is proud of you. So I feel like this, this is why this reward is coming in. Look, a wish granted. You deserve this. You really, really do. And you're going to get exactly what you deserve. Wow, this is amazing. Look, God's love. Look, positive energy, good news, positive energy. And this is you using your intuition. It's like because you used your intuition, because you were strong. Look, I see I see something else hanging out. I thought that was the strength card. Yeah. I feel like somebody is going to be making you some type of offer. But we did see this defeat card. But I feel like this is you defeating your enemies. I really feel like this is you defeating your enemies. It's not you feeling defeated. I feel like during a time of challenge, you're going to be victorious. I feel like you're victorious against the people that lied to you, the people that deceived you, the people that tried to get over on you. I feel like your wisdom, use your intuition so people won't deceive you and won't deny you or whatever this is. But this is positive movement forward to you. You're going to be happy. All right. This is going to be beautiful energy for you. This is the chariot. So positive movement forward. <laughs> Somebody's going to feel real defeated and jealous. Somebody tried to be very underhanded to you. And I feel like this blessing is going to trump whatever they tried to do. Somebody could have tried to stop you. They could have tried to stop your wish or something like that. Somebody, this 
whoever this is right here could have tried to stop you and they could have tried to be underhanded and cut you off or not make it make things work for you but spirit said baby it's gonna work today so i feel like when somebody tried to tell you no somebody tried to hold you back somebody tried to make you feel defeated god stepped in for real for real that's exactly what i feel and i feel like he turned your situation of lack around to a situation of wealth and success Whatever this is, bro, get ready for it because you're going to be extremely happy. This got me excited. Um, but I feel like you have to work through your emotions because all of the other cards that came out, these little things you need to work through so you can really fully enjoy your blessing. But yes, you <laughs> get ready. It says courage, have courage. Fear is natural and it invites us to be brave, accept and face what scares you. So you may be fearful of something with this trapped in fear. Fear of moving forward. Fear of embracing this huge change in your life. Some of you are elevating your stars. You're successful. And you could be a bit fearful about what to do. How to move forward. Like, it's a lot to take in. You didn't expect this to happen. And you definitely didn't expect it to happen so fast. But it's happening. It's a huge transformation. Wow. So embrace fear. Walk towards your blessing. You're not alone. And you are... You deserve this. Like, this is destined for you. So keep keep your arms open wide and receive your blessing. Just say thank you, okay? I love you guys and thank you for being here with me. I will see you later on on the next video. I was so tired last night, y'all. I was falling asleep. So I couldn't do the live, but I will do it tonight. I'm going to be ready for you tonight, baby. All right, Virgo. Thank you guys for your likes, shares, and subscribes. Book your reading at closer to number two, my destiny .com, And I will see you later. Bye, loveys. I'm going to get my nails done.